was coming up and he, um, he wasn't home yet. So I grabbed my keys and jumped in the car. He wasn't answering his cell phone. And when I rounded the corner is when I saw the fire trucks and the big truck and, um, uh, a semi had run through a light too fast and he came home to be with the Lord. My whole life was crumbling around me. My, you know, I came home, told the kids and my house filled with people. And I remember that afternoon, I just, um, that evening, I just went into uh, the bedroom, crumbled to the floor, didn't even make it to the bed. And I told God, I really am not happy. Um, my, you know, I, when, when you're a pastor's wife, you kind of lose everything. You lose ministry, you lose your past and you lose your pastor, you lose your husband and you lose your identity. Cause I was a pastor's wife for 27 years. That's, that's who I was. Mm -hmm. And so, um, at that moment, I just told God I can choose. I know I have a choice. I can 